but that's a good possession by Butler. Make St. John's guard you the entire possession. And Posh Alexander with the pull up. He's done. And that's a 50 50 ball that goes to Butler, results in a three. Inside to Soriano with the right hand. Right here on Fox. Coverage begins at 5 Eastern. Champagne off the window and another time. Good job being set. Wheeler on the roll to Alexander and gives it off to Nye. time at St. John's has played three Big East games in five days since the 80s. A real test of this team's character and strength as Alexander rolls to the cup. Wusu rattles in at the emphasis there. Colburn makes his first turnovers if you're bothered to get transition defense, transition defense, transition defense. Nobody picks. Great heads up play. And now Alexander underneath an extra pass to Soriano. Uh, Inzi's done a great job of feeling the body and, and attacking and scoring. Right back the other way. When you look at it, I mean, they're 323 in the country at three point percent. Soriano. Five. A turnover gives it back to the Johnnies. Two on one. Alexander oh, finished. Sure. And they are. They're playing, but you can see it. Champagne. Through, sent it over to Nywe. Butler bench wanted to travel out of Wusu to beat the buzzer. That's a three, and we're tied again at 41. Mathis right back the other way. That only shoots it at 31% on the year. Champagne on the drive and through traffic lays it in. Soriano with the right hand and the foot. Get in the paint. Look at St. John's. What have they done? They've got the ball in the paint. They've attacked. They've been really John's under six minutes left to the ball game. Wheeler elevating and knocks it in. Alexander gives it up to Soriano. If you were to say who's going to favor, you'd say it's going to favor Butler, but St. John's has been the one to be the more aggressive team, even though it's not. In the Champagne, St. John's. Snaps a seven-game losing streak at Hinkle Fieldhouse. They've now won back-to-back -back games, and the tournament hopes still alive for the Red Storm.